this anger and all of this thing things go away I, I honestly think that he might come back and apologize emotional so i started going to twitter maybe he'll do that maybe he don't if he don't try it's okay i've already forgiven i have already forgiven so here i am now no kids fucking single and i'm i'm figuring it out y'all i'm good though i'm just really staying busy and you know most women we don't lead a relationship after thinking about a month y'all this has been something that's been going on in my head for a while but the love for him made me stay for so fucking long that's why i stayed for so long y'all because I just knew that shit was going to get better. I just knew it was going to get better, y'all. But I'm not going to lie. Y'all, when I bought that house by myself, when I wrote that check for 217000 y'all, that shit hurt me, y'all. That shit hurt. I don't care what y'all saw. I don't know if y'all noticed. Since we bought that house, y'all, I don't know if y'all noticed, we ain't, I ain't been doing YouTube because I was angry inside about how that shit played out. I was so angry about how all that shit played out. I really was. I was so fucking pissed the fuck off. I was like, I can't fucking believe this shit. I can't believe I'm doing this. But he kept on telling me like, Things going to get better. Things going to get better. You know, he had the brand. He had the clothing brand. And things going to get better. Trust me. Things going to get better. Things going to get better. I'm going to do this. I'm going to give you this back. I'm going to give you half of that back. I'm going to give you this half back. I, and, and being with somebody for five years, yes, naturally, yeah. I know y'all might be like, you, you a dummy. You're a dummy. You thought he was going to. Listen, yes, the fuck I did. Yes. So again, I feel like y'all ain't got to tell me I took an L. I know I took an L. I'm living with my L. I'm living with my L, y'all. So, you know. <sighs> I'm living with my L. That's all I can say. I'm living with that motherfucker. Every time I walk in that house by myself, y'all, I'm living with it. I'm living with it. I'm absolutely living with that shit. And that, I ain't gonna lie, that shit sometimes makes me so upset. Like, that shit really pisses me off sometimes. But everybody keep on saying, you know, girl, we all do crazy things. I never did nothing this crazy, though. This is my first. And I hope to God that this is my last. Yes, I gave the ring back. I'm not savage like that, y'all. I gave the ring back with respect. I didn't give it back screaming. I didn't give it back cursing. I just gave it back. I don't. I feel like you know he bought the ring, and why would I keep the fucking ring? So I gave it back, and gave it back. So now my new life is I'm trying to stay busy. I just got two major opportunities, y'all, and I'm, I can't talk about them yet because they haven't happened yet. And I don't want to talk about nothing that didn't happen, but I got two major opportunities and I'm hoping to God that they come through, y'all. I am hoping to God that they come through. But between that, I am just staying busy. I guess my new life, y'all. I'm just I'm just staying busy I'm staying busy so again uh, just wanted to tell y'all <laughs> in account of the three things that he said I took from him I just explained why those things happened anything else I will you know 
I guess when time heal that I will try to figure out a way to do it with class where it don't look like I'm trying to bash nobody and it don't look like like I'm doing it from a ugly place. You know what I'm saying? Because you know women, we do stuff from ugly places sometimes and it's natural. When you feel like you've been used, when you feel like you've been taken advantage of, as I do feel that way, we women, we we will start being so ugly and and I never want to, I don't, I don't want to do that. Because you don't know what the future holds. You do not know what the future holds. And that's that. So for the supporters. You know. If y'all were wondering why I'm in the house. I just told you why. I paid for it. It's mine. Um. The truck, again, is in my name. He said he can't afford it right now. And so, Nashley, what do you do? I'm going to keep my credit alive. Now, guess what? I got two choices. Pay the truck note or sell the truck. I got two choices, but I have to look out for me, y'all. And I cannot let my credit go down. I've worked too fucking hard coming from where I came from to let this shit go on my name, y'all. So, I really got to hustle. I really got to hustle. And listen, I I see what y'all saying. He's talking about me, y'all. It's okay. It is okay. I have told y'all the truth. That is the truth. And whatever you decide to leave and take it, it's okay. It's okay. I am good with it. I understand that hurt people are hurt. Honestly, I would rather y'all just pray for him. I know he might be a little embarrassed right now, but listen, I'm embarrassed too. And we both got to put our big big girl and big boy draws on and we got to move forward, y'all. We got to move forward. And that's it. I feel light now i feel like i could i'm gonna do bad by myself y'all with this house with this mortgage with them car payments with them dogs with them high ass bills y'all i'm gonna do bad by myself if i'm gonna do it i'm gonna do bad by my fucking self i knew that was bachi bachi <laughs> they've been a high ball y'all can't have my friend y'all can't have my friend no. Bachi, don't, don't make like my drink on my phone. I don't, I don't got my like queso. Y'all. They don't like, like you. People. Me either. So, so, do you like your friend? I'm not available. I love you. This is my dog. Bachi love me. Bachi gonna but love me for years. I don't like y'all. <laughs> it's okay. You don't gotta like them. I love I'm them. I'm single and I'm taking. It's complicated. Mind your business. It's complicated. Ooh. Thank you, Bachi. It's getting warm over here. I haven't been smoking weed lately, but I swear the smell of this weed, y'all, is tempting me. But um, I'm gonna predict. I'm gonna tell y'all what he gonna say, y'all. He gonna say that he helped me with my hair business that I started five years ago. But y'all gotta ask him this question. Ask this question. If you help start my hair business. And I gained the money. Why you ain't? What you do with it? You know. Listen, he's he's been saying that to people for years. Anytime we get in an argument, first thing he gonna say is. First thing he gonna say. I helped you support your hair business when you started it years ago. That's what you're supposed to do. You are my man. You're supposed to support my hair business. 